This is 6 News. Coverage you can count on. We do miss him, though. If he was one of us. Norm's gas station on Brady Street in Dubois isn't just a place where you fill up your tank. To William Pierce, Norman Schaefer and Norm's customers were his second family, a friendship they called Sunday Church. We always had our Saturday and Sundays together. Schaefer says like clockwork, Pierce would be sitting in the parking lot waiting for him on the weekends. We had donuts and coffee and we ate and we just had good times together and he visited with all my other customers that were here. It was one of those things that he looked forward to. And if you step inside the shop, though the chairs are now empty, Schaefer says they used to be filled with laughs and chatter about the world, home life and work. Just like a family, that's what it was like. And sometimes they'd talk sports, but most of the time he would tell us about his work and then ask us how ours was going, and that's the way it was, like a family deal. <laughs> Schaefer says his customers ask about Pierce all the time and that he's thankful his coffee and conversation brought Pierce into his life. A great fella. We miss him, though. But his extended family didn't stop at norms. We'll not forget Bill for a long time. As Pierce was a lifelong member of the Oklahoma Civilian Defense Fire Company in Sandy Township, joining in 1994. Bill was always a joking kind of guy. He was a, he was a people person and he was friendly to everybody and would always try to joke around and bring a smile to somebody. Pierce was an active firefighter during his first six years with the department. After that time period, became a social member with our company. Uh, held several positions, most notable would be as a trustee with our fire company. President Mark Sullivan says Pierce helped out with fundraising and that his favorite event was country music night. And because he lived right next door, he took care of the day-to-day -day operations at the fire hall. If you'd ever drive around the fire hall, you'd see Bill. He'd be in the yard in the neighborhood. Many times I go by and I, I'm looking for him, but he's not there. Um, so he, he's missed. Hanging on a wall inside the place Pierce formed a brotherhood, two plaques are inscribed with his name, life member, and in memoriam. When Bill was in the fire hall, you knew it. Bill was a very uh, warm-hearted person, uh, always liked to joke around. His fire family says they'll grasp onto the memories of him and stick together. Holidays, birthday parties, we're up and out leaving our families and, and coming here. So we kind of pull together at times like this. And we'll, we'll share memories of him and that's how, how we remember him.